Yeah, like I say, something we're talking about the 85,000. That's not the total figure. I asked Peggy to run out the numbers. Uh, 85,000 salary, you're talking about 113.8. And if we have the car allowance, you're talking about another 6,000. We're talking about close to 120,000 total cost for the city for the package. Um, I don't know. What, to me, with the economy where it is right now, uh, a lot of people in this city are, are, are laid off. I just, uh, we're talking about poss possibility of raising taxes. And even if we didn't raise taxes, that's a lot of money that could go somewhere else for streets or curbing. Uh, of all things, city administrator, I think we expect them to do. I think a lot of that's been performed right now by the city uh, superintendent. And uh, I talked to uh, some different cities, uh, one or two, and they said that they had more success. They went through <coughs> some managers, administrators, and finally you know, moved somebody up through the ranks, and that's what they ended up with. And uh, I, I know it's not a perfect world, and, and uh, if we move somebody up, but if there's some way we can work with, I feel comfortable with that. Whereas if we bring somebody in from outside, you, you don't know what you're getting. And I don't feel real comfortable with that because we're kind of bringing somebody internally that's arranged on. I feel more comfortable with a known somebody we've already got in the system. That'd be the way I'd, I'd prefer to go instead of bringing somebody in. Uh, 